it took two people to get me to being silk. One, my leader who turned around and told me in no uncertain terms it should be me doing what he was doing, that I was more than able to do that. And someone else who bought me the patent black shoes and said you're more than entitled to be wearing these, now fill in the form. Being told by someone you respect can give you the courage to step forward. I have a big family and I think that wasn't always the best thing to do at the bar. It was very difficult early on and the encouragement from other women really kept me going, especially when times were difficult. The opponent I was against today was another woman who was incredibly talented. She didn't realise how good she was and she was too hard on herself. Well, I used to lack confidence in myself and I was very shy as a younger person. Without um, strong female role models, I would never be a QC. Talk to each other, encourage each other, get together, network, help, advise and have fun together. Find a woman that you admire, that you think is talented, ask her how she's done it. We need more women QCs and we need more women in the judiciary. We as women have a duty to help each other. We don't have to like each other. We don't have to agree with each other. But we do, in my opinion, have a duty to encourage and help each other. Last year, when I was chair of the Young Bar, was really challenging. I couldn't have done that if I hadn't had some amazing women in my corner. No matter how confident or talented a barrister you may be, there will always be a moment where you have a crisis of confidence. There will be times which are difficult and you have to keep plugging away and believe in yourself. It's so important for women to be visible and to support each other so that during those moments of crisis or having a wobble, you keep going. The profession should be diverse. A diverse profession is good for society. The bar can be a very lonely place and for years I lacked the confidence to even visualise myself as a potential QC. The turning point for me was when I was encouraged to apply by a senior male member of my chambers. Making the application gave me the confidence I needed. We need more women to become silks because the profession and the public are missing out on an enormous amount of talent. If someone helped you, it's your turn to do the same. Pay it forward. Spot a talented woman and tell her to take the next step. Pay it forward. Somebody encouraged me, so it's now my turn to encourage somebody else. If that's your position, that's what you need to do as well. Find another woman you know who's talented. Encourage her to take the next step. If somebody helped you, pay it forward. For every woman who you have rated or thought was good but not said it to, go out and tell them. Give their confidence a boost today.